नमस्ते आई एम मंजुला वेलकम टू मंजुलास किचन टुडे आई विल बी मेकिंग कॉकटेल समोसा दीज आर टेस्टी ट्रीट कॉकटेल समोसा आर बाइट साइज एंड क्रिस्पी समोसा फिल्ड विद स्पाइसी ग्रीन पीस दीज आर सिंपली द बेस्ट टी टाइम स्नैक और एपिटाइजर कॉकटेल समोसा गोज रियली वेल विद टेमरिन चटनी This recipe will make 24 samosas and will serve six. To make samosas, first we will make dough. One cup of all-purpose flour, plain flour or maida, one tablespoon of fine suji semolina, one fourth teaspoon of salt, two tablespoons of oil, and approximately one third cup of lukewarm water. For filling. We need two cups of green peas. I am using the frozen green peas. I have already boiled, drained, and pat dried the green peas. Two tablespoons of oil, three teaspoons of coriander powder, dhania, one teaspoon of red chili powder, lal mirch, one teaspoon of mango powder, amchur, three fourths teaspoon of salt, and one fourth teaspoon of garam masala. first i will make the dough so first let's mix the dry flour together all purpose flour semolina salt mix it well now add the oil again mix it and now add the water so this will make soft dough okay dough is looking very good and i have used 1/3 cup of water so cover the dough and let it sit for at least 10 minutes i will be making the filling so i will mix all the spices to the green peas so salt pepper गरम मसाला कोरिएंडर पाउडर मैंगो पाउडर एंड मिक्स विद योर फिंगर्स एंड जस्ट मैश इट लिटिल बिट वाइल यू आर मिक्सिंग सो आई हैव मिक्स्ड ऑल दी स्पाइसेस एंड इट्स लुकिंग गुड एंड आई हैव मैश्ड इट लिटिल बिट एंड एज यू सी दे आर सम ऑफ द ग्रीन पीज आर मैश्ड सो नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू स्टिर फ्राई heat is on medium and i am ready to stir fry the filling oil and peas keep stirring the peas and keep mashing so it uh, nicely stir get stir fry and we need to uh, evaporate the water from the peas and this should take about 8 to 10 minutes okay peas are looking good they are dry and i have mashed them quite a bit while i was stir frying and as you see but it's not a pasty so i'm going to turn off the heat and put it in the plate so it will cool off and by the way it took me about 8 minutes this has been about 15 minutes so dough should be ready so dough is looking good i will just knead the dough for few seconds and then divide in 12 equal parts okay so looks like i made 13 so just roll them very smooth and press it to make patties Okay, so I will roll few of them at a time. So just put it down, press it, and roll. It should be about four and a half inch in diameter. Okay, next one.
you don't need to put any oil or any flour to roll these samosas. So I decided to roll all of them. So this is the last one. And now I am ready to fill the samosas. So take one circle and cut it in the half and pick up, wet your finger and just go around. This will help to hold the samosas so filling doesn't come out. Just make a cone, easy, just put it like this and press it, it's important to press. Now put one spoon of filling. And just press it in and again close it and close it by pinching you need to make sure it's closed right let's do the another one just go around with the bad fingers make a cone press it and just put one spoon of filling and press it and close it from the end it should be closed very nicely because you want to make sure it doesn't open when you are frying I have filled all the samosas and as you see samosas are looking really nice i am ready to fry them heat is on medium high oil should be moderately hot okay when you are putting the samosas in the oil and this should sizzle but uh, just come up very slowly because they should take about uh, seven to eight minutes uh, in frying if you fry them on very high heat they will get cooked quick and they won't be crispy don't overlap just put enough okay this looks good as you see uh, oil is sizzling uh, and they are coming up uh, slowly you do have to turn them few times and they should be nicely golden brown from both sides samosas are ready have a very nice brown color so it's time to take them out and I like to take them out over the paper towel so it absorbs some extra oil and samosas are ready to be served cocktail samosas are looking great nice and crispy this is a delicacy this is my mom's recipe who was a wonderful cook she will make these samosa for a special get together and everyone will love it. And she received many many compliments. Cocktail green pea samosas go really well with tamarind chutney. Enjoy. Thank you. Till we meet again, check out more recipes on manjulaskitchen.com.